finished talking to Thomas Yerko, and here's a guy who's got experience, but yet comes to camp maybe uh, far from a long shot, but fighting for a job. And I wonder what you like about his fight to come come in here and just sort of prove himself. You know, he's played a couple of real good games, and he's he's uh, been nicked up with a couple of injuries that kind of took a couple of games away from him that, that we'd like to see him in. But he's, uh, you know, he's come in. He's got good skill. He thinks the game pretty well. Um, you know, you see the two goals he got last night. One's a bang bang play, but the other one's a heck of a move and, and scoring on the power play. So he's an intriguing guy. We need to add depth scoring in our lineup. He's a guy that's come in and um, offered a little bit of that. You know, he'll play tomorrow night. Hopefully, we can continue to see what he's got. You've talked about you know some positions in the top six open, and I mean, you put him with Connor with the idea. Okay, well, he's our best player, and you got a couple of best players along yeah. with Leon, and just throw him out there and see. Well, let's see what he can do, basically. Yeah, he did all right. Did all right, so we'll continue to see where it goes. We got a few guys in that uh, in that vein still, and we got to figure out where everybody fits. Dave, when it comes to your trip, is finding consistency the key for a guy like that who's kind of been up and down over the course of his yeah. pro career? How do you coax that out of a guy? Yeah, is that I, well, it's it's consistency and doing little things right. And I think early in his career, I think he was, uh, you know, he was. Probably if you had to weight him on one side or the other, it was the uh, offensive side and thought if he didn't produce offensively, he didn't, uh, he didn't contribute. Now I think he's got a mindset he needs to be a good two-way player. You know, he has to be able to play in his own end. He has to play, be able to play against top players. And then, but hopefully he can complement good players with his skill level. And then Dave, um, just with Mike Smith, how do you think his puck playing factor has, has kind of evolved in his first First full game. It's been solid. You know, he just, it's a different dy dimension for RD. Um, you know, last night he was out and he handled it quite a few times last night. It's just, that's part of his game. It's a, it's a good part. I know everybody says, oh, it's scary. And they're out time one turns over. And for years, everybody asked me, when, you know, are you tell him to stop it? No, he, he helps the game. How many times it goes back there and he helps RD, helps uh, move the puck out of our end. But that being, said, that being said, Schmitty's been pretty solid in the two games he's played here, so I like where his game's at. His puck handling is just a good part of his game that uh, our group's going to have to adjust to.